Welcome back everyone, hope you're having an awesome day, and today we're going to continue on our Deva Pilot campaign on hard. Last mission we made sure to, uh, we made the Huna Horse Lords regret, renounce their wicked ways, I could not speak, I cannot speak, every word is muddling itself. And now we move down to the Panjals it looks like, uh, to liberate question mark them. So make sure to like, comment, subscribe. We are doing all the campaigns on hard, getting all the achievements where we can. There is an achievement tied to this one. Uh, we need to stop the Rushtra Kutra Wonder from being built. Uh, from Well, being completed, I should say. It will start being built, I would assume. We'll see how we go. And uh, sit back, relax. I do have a coffee here, but I have a cover over it to keep it nice and warm. So let's move on to Devil Parlor 4. Liberation? It is in one's own mind. Not their enemy or foe that lures them to evil ways, said the Buddha. As I feared, our emperor had indeed changed. The seed of self-righteousness, planted long ago and nurtured by uninterrupted success, had begun to bear fruit. In Devapala's mind, the ends now justified the means no matter how terrible or costly. And so he ordered a campaign to the south to subjugate the Pandyas, a proud people who were former allies and trading partners of his, and bring them the teachings of the Buddha. When word of this reached me, I burst into my emperor's chambers, begging him to reconsider. Needless aggression is not the mark of a virtuous ruler, I said and forced conversion only thickens the resolve of a people against the creed. I told him that this war would cost thousands of lives and bring suffering to countless more. But the words that once guided him towards the path of light now fell on deaf ears. It is as one is the summit of the mountain that the footing becomes most treacherous. Now all I could do was helplessly watch as the armies of a tyrant descended upon a new victim. We bring peace and love and security to my new empire. I think I've already made that joke. I'm pretty sure I made that joke before. Defeat the Pandyas by destroying their castles. Easy. Devapala begins in the Imperial Age but is restricted to a pop limit of 150. Be aggressive, you be, be aggressive. You have a limited number of villages and can fish the sea, but your main source of supplies will be conquering enemy settlements. Classic. Bengali ships regenerate hit points over time. Preserving damaged ones will save you precious resources. Do not destroy what you can conquer. Leveling an enemy castle will give you control of the nearby buildings. Concentrate on your objectives. Delay too much and you could quite well run out of resources. Devapala and his forces approach Pandya borders and are ready to expand their domain to the south. The Pandyas control several settlements along the Bay of Bengal. Their forces of infantry ranged units are initially no match for the Pala army, but should be dealt with before they are able to bolster their resistance. The Rashtra Kutras rule the lands beyond the mountains to the west, northwest and north. Their foot soldiers and elephants have not engaged the Palas yet, but as, known, as a known rival, they should be watched. Your wish is my command, cousin. I will bring the feeble pandyas to heal, Damn. whatever the cost. Feeble pandyas. Whoa, hang on, what? We've got I'm not so swords. sure about this venture, venerable Devapala. Cool. War only creates more dissatisfaction and suffering, Group not one. less. Alright, what we should do... Oh, first we'll get conscription and we'll get a couple of those. Hi. Sure. Uh, not doing anything. Ability to obtain supplies is limited. We should look to the sea for food and plunder the contents of enemy castles. Look what we should do and what we will do with two different things. If you must conquer these lands, please do so as swiftly and as bloodlessly as you can. Probably should have got shipwrecked. Every right. drop of blood spilled is a step away from your enlightenment. But we will once, make do. There is sense in the advisor's words. For once. Let's construct a fleet. We can level the Pandya fortifications from the sea. I doubt that very much. Wait, do we get... We do get cannon galleons. Even though they were like, you can't have cannon galleons. 
Right, I don't think my uh, my docks are going to be very good here. Oh, hello, we've got... Everyone in here, please. Nice, get wrecked. Arbalists. Alright, so what I'm hearing is... Can I not? Oh, maybe it's Gajaras. I'm think I might be thinking of Gajaras can put stuff in there. Docks. That's fine. Look, that's fine. These docks will keep them busy. Uh, okay. Let's get Blast Furnace as well. Uh, Do I have a university? I don't have a university. I should probably build one at some point. That's fine. I'm sure it's fine. But we've got. Adish, hi. Actually, in theory, I should be able to get that from here. Do yeah. I need to stop doing this. Let's build this so we can get maybe like siege engineers in that. There is, yeah, it's not an ideal uh, gold mine, is it? Okay, so far, it has not been ideal. We do have. Oh no, siege engineers. Away, horse swords. Hi. We have leveled up Bandia Castle. The land that it defended okay. is ours now. Let's get sage engineers. Fala armies venturing this far south. Yes. What are you doing? Here, what are you doing, step conqueror? Oh, no. I don't know. No, that made me feel weird. <laughs> I didn't like that. So, my mind went there immediately and I just regretted it. <laughs> Alright, let's bring our troops down. We should probably get another couple troops if we can. We cannot, so it's fine. Actually, I can probably. Just... A couple more troops, let's bring them out here. Alright, next castle, we move our troops forward. Once more into the breach. We are now somehow getting food income from the sea, which is nice. It's nice to see. We do have a lot of food, however. That's unfortunate for that guy. Getting chased by an alligator. Get those Dravidians, show him his boss. So we don't need to actually like chase them or anything. Um, I probably don't need architecture. I feel like I'm not getting attacked really. I also have my upgrades. We're pretty good on upgrades, really. Three. The land that it defended is ours now. Yes. We'll pack up. And continue our troops forward. We should probably do one. The Pandia lands will fall. And then what? Will you enforce your dogmatic rule upon all of India? Let's get Mahayana. You know, we lose... We've got how many? We've got ten villages. Lose one population space. Um, actually, I should have these areas. Uh, yeah, so I could build elephant arches... Infantry, infantry, I'm not even gonna bother looking at. Hi, Shokuturi. Just bring our troops down. I'm not meant to be killing units as well, just saw that. Defeat the Pandyas while killing fewer than a hundred units. Oh, we have some docks here. Alright, I guess. Let's make a handful of units, I guess. 
Let's just kind of see if we can just kind of. Oh, that's all you want. It's fine. We, you know, we've got 40 more units that we can knock out. We should be okay. That being said, they keep sending troops up. Maybe not. 74, as far as I can see. Plus boats, I guess. If we have any boats anyway. But as you can see, we are. Yeah, 74. Yeah, we'll be fine. I'm pretty sure we'll be fine. I think we just kind of pushed our troops forward. Uh, do we have. We do have a couple of stables here too, so we can get. build up another force. Uh, pack her up. Your conduct has inspired monks to bring the word of the Buddha to your nose. We have leveled a bandit castle. I heard the monk the sound. Land I was like, oh. is ours now. Pandya lands are ours now, cousin. Nice. This is outrageous. <laughs> we will not sit idly by. Radio. I just like the idea of him going like, this is outrageous, I'm gonna build it, and just build a thing of a, um, and wonder. Alright, we'll just get our upgrades. Um, at this point I think, Pan yeah, Pandy is knocked out. So I th think I should be safe in building more fishing ships. Really pushing that uh, food eco out. Some more. Do we have some? We do here. Yep. Get a couple more here. Really, we've really kicked that eco off. Um, we've got our relics in here, which I like. Um, Mahayana's not useful. I don't have any rafters. I don't really want to build rafters, so that's fine. Wood-wise, we're doing okay, so... I suppose we could sell some more wood. Buy a little bit more food. And just make sure we've got the upgrades we need. If anything, the only upgrade I really want is Elite uh, Elephant Archer. 1,000 food, 800 gold. Uh, food's not really a problem. We're almost, we're almost at Elite Elephant Archer, then. There we go. So if we do that... I have one horse lord left. We'll just send our trebs up. I think our trebs should be should do enough for that. Group two. Hi. Yeah, I Please, thank you. Right, let's go. Hi. These people. Follow these, I guess. Group one. Let's go. We need a song. What's that song by Fleetwood Mac? Is it Tuss? Like the elephant one's like, do, do, do. And just as we're moving our elephants across the. Oh my goodness, we just got a castle for no reason. Nice. So we have, hang on, destroy the Russia, destroy enemy castles to conquer settlements. Okay, so that must be, if we knock out their castles, we get those buildings. It's like, I suppose it would stop their forward bases as well, so. You got bikemen. Mm, okay, that's fine. We've got a nice amount of archers that I'm not super worried about it. Hi, Plus, our uh, monks should be able to help us. No, the should. Group three. We'll just do that and let them kind of decide what they want to do, hey? Alright, we've 
We've got some, uh... As I said, we've got a lot of elephants here, so I think we'll be okay. At the very least, we can, uh, kind of do stuff. There we are. Nice, they all just set up immediately. Have any more troops? Yep, we've got more troops there. Let's go up here. Group one. Alright, that's a big army coming this way. Not a big fan of that. Knock out that town soon enough, but all nice. This Rashtrakuta castle lies in ruins. Secure the buildings and continue our thrust into enemy territory. Yes, thrust forward. Wait. <laughs> Will the supplies that you plunder be enough to feed your star? I. Yes. Uh, we'll just move our troops up here just so they're out of the way, you know. So, uh, they're coming down here. It looks like they're coming down to my castle, and if they do that, uh, the castle will deal with them. Hi. Nice, I got it. I got a siege elephant. Get rid of the archers there. Alright. This isn't an ideal kind of situation. That being said, we have such a good eco that we're just spamming units forward. So I'm okay with all of this. Hi. Hi. I also lost a monk and I'm not a big fan of that either, so. You start knocking that out. Group one. One. Krebs are kind of freaking out a little bit, but it's okay. Hi. Uh, how is that one to go on? Oh, we'll be fine. Back her up. So right, I'll take a couple extra more hits there. This Rashtrakuta castle lies in ruins. Secure the buildings and continue our Forty-six units. Oh, territory. and we got this too. We got this little base up here. Are you going to kill me, Devapala? I mean, probably. If you're going to stand in my way, I yes, I'm you. going to kill you. Hi. <laughs> oh no. Um, I suppose woodcutting. I don't know. Actually, didn't wasn't there gold mines in here? I remember it was there. Are, there's gold mines over here. Can't do those. And when you finish that, oh my goodness! Look at all those fishing ships. More gold here. Do that. That way they're still moving. You know. Um. Whatever. We'll do Aristlis. We have a couple of towers up there in that area. I have converted a siege elephant. So I don't really need one. We'll do Theocracy and Block Printing, just on the off chance I start converting more stuff. Hi. My goodness, that's a lot of castles. Your dear mother hailed from these lands, Devamala. Your invasion spits on her memory. Yeah, well, I didn't like my mum anyway. It's almost like a slow motion attack. Oh, that's a gate there. I thought it was just a wall. That's unfortunate. Please knock out that gate. Move our troops forward, hit that area. That wonder is half built. Hi. You dare threaten oh, our glorious temple. Tread the castles, tread the castles. Nice. Alright, Trebs will do this. 
That being said though, that wall gave way. I don't know why I'm knocking out this, but we'll do it anyway. Move our troops forward. And knock out the wonder. I think that's game. The fact that they give you like all these forward bases at the point where you just have and you keep making just units. It's a bit how you going, you know? Nice. Those villagers are so hell bent on getting that wonder done. <laughs> Achievement got. Your arrogance has led you to destroy this great temple. Well, and for they would have won otherwise. What do you mean? Buddha weeps while the gods shut up their eyes in scorn. Well, scorn all you want, mate. Your marauding will not break the resolve of my people. What people? There's no one left. Ha! <laughs> Remember at the start when I was like, yes, no, we need to be peaceful, we need to be alright. And then there's one mission, it's like, yes, murder everything, thank you. You only lose what you cling to, said the Buddha. Devapala found that to be all too true. The more he tightened his grip on the south, the more it, or perhaps more accurately its ashes, slipped through his fingers. My emperor and his bellicose cousin had created a nightmare. Bellicose, there was no cheer or pride to be felt. As the Bala army struck its tents and began the long march back home, the stench of death and smoke choked the air, punctuated by the haunting wails of the broken people that my emperor and his forces left behind. Tormented by the recognition of his arrogance and its price, Devapala breathed not a single word during the entire week-long journey home. I feel like he would have said something. 181? That's actually a lot less than I thought. Oh yeah, no, we did get a lot of tribute from... Yeah, I remember that. 1500 relic gold, that's actually not too bad. I suppose I had three relics. Anything kind of here? Not really. This. Oh my god, look at this giant. <laughs> Massive fishing ships. Terrible. Terrible, Muriel. Um, yeah, so get that. Fewer than 100, you get the three relics. That really helped me keep my forces going. Um, but as you see, we just pretty much just elephant stomp the entire map. Like, as you get to new areas, you just build a couple, like, you know, we have stuff, I don't know where these people are going, but... Stables here, archery ranges, a couple other, I mean, there's barracks, but who uses barracks, you know? Alrighty, a nice easy mission. Um, granted, it's an easy campaign. But yes. Uh, thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. We have beaten it. Uh, we got the achievement. Constru construction cancellation. I can't say it. Uh, now, after that, we'll move on to the last mission. I think, I'm pretty sure there's five missions in this one. For enlightenment. So, catch you around. Like, comment, subscribe. Doing all the campaigns on hard. See you around.